Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our channel. It's Taylor. Today I'm doing an Ipsy unboxing and try on for October. If you guys like the video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, also turn on that bell to notify when we post new videos. That's all for the intro. Let's get into the video. So first up, we have the Orza Beauty Astro Amethyst Shimmer Eyeshadow Palette. This is a full size. It retails for $20 and it comes with three shimmers and one matte shade. I did not like this eyeshadow palette <laughs> whatsoever. The brown shade blended pretty well, but then the shimmers, you'll see in a minute, they were not it. I tried using the purple and that didn't work, so I put the more bronzy shade on top and it looked a little bit better. I feel like if you like cool tones, you like this palette. I don't really like cool tones, so maybe that's why. But this palette also has a very weird smell, so yeah. Next up we have the It Cosmetics Lash Blowout Salon Volume Lift Mascara. That is a mouthful. It says this mascara gives your lashes insane curl and volume. Um, I'll let you be the judge of that. I don't think it did. I don't think it did anything for my lashes. Next up, I'm using the Balm Cosmetics Well Powder Blush in the shade Stamina. Um, the blush was fine. It's kind of like the same shade family that I usually use. So, it was fine. Nothing wrong. Nothing extremely good about it either, but I like it. I'm using an item from my Ipsy Glam Plus bag. I'm using the Violet Voss lip gloss in the shade Fresh. I'm not a gloss person, but I really like this gloss. It smells like a lip gloss you would get in like early 2000s at the beauty supply store. Um, it had, it was a little tingly. I don't know if it was supposed to be a plumping lip gloss, but besides that, I really liked it. Now getting into the rest of the items that I didn't use, starting off with the Ipsy Glam bag. This is a Mojito Lip Balm. I'm not sure how to pronounce the name, but the full size of this retails for $14. Next up we have the Moda Pro Fan Brush and this retails for $5.99. Now moving on to the Glam Bag Plus. This is the Pure Lease Blue Lotus 401 Cleansing Milk and I think this is a full size. Next up we have another mascara. This one is from Ciate London. It's the Triple Shot XXL Mascara. This is the Dr. Brand Pore Derm Abrasion. I use this today and it low key burnt my skin, but my texture felt good. So while I keep using it, who knows? Last but not least, we have the Tarte Shape Tape Setting Powder. So that's it for the video from the products that I tried out. My favorite product, and surprisingly the gloss, and I am not a gloss person, but this gloss, I really like it. It smells good and kind of weird at the same time. A little bit tingly. I'm not sure if it's supposed if it's supposed to be a lip <laughs> if it's supposed to be a lip plumping gloss. I don't think so. Slightly tingly, but nothing too bad. My least favorite product is definitely the eyeshadow palette. It's just I don't know. I think this retails for like twenty five dollars if I'm not wrong. I think it retails for twenty five ish dollars for this one. The Elf one are three dollars and they come with four colors too and they're more pigmented and they blend better but so that's it for the unboxing thank you guys so much for watching but before you go don't forget to give us a thumbs up subscribe to our channel and turn on that bell to notify when we can try and i post new videos that's it see you guys next time and bye guys